Hello, and welcome to Grug Gaming. And welcome back to our Let's Play of Elden Ring. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button. If you've been around for a while, thanks for watching. Uh, we are playing Elden Ring, and we are trying to see everything we can, and it's a brand new game, and who knows? So, last episode, we were down here, and we took out this uh, Forlorn Hound Evergoal. We haven't mapped this edge right here yet, and we still have this little section here to do um, for Limgrave. But I was looking at the map, and I want to check out this, and I want to check out this. I want to see what that's all about. So, that's what we're going to do today. That's what we, the plan we're going to start with today. Who knows what we're actually going to do. I mean, as is common, we may accomplish nothing. You know how this goes. Alright, so we're just going to skirt around the camp. I mean, we've wiped that camp out multiple times in our lives. And I'm just kind of looking up here, making sure there's no, uh... No... What are they called? Uh, caves! Caves are what they're called. Uh, we're getting way off track, though. Back down here. I'm looking for... There's the road. It says there's a thing. Is that the thing? That's not the thing, but it looks interesting. What is this? Is this just a graveyard? <gasps> is that a dude? On a horse? Are you a boss? Oh! My buddy! No! Oh, okay. He's too fast for my... Ow! Okay, we can block a boss on horseback, but not this guy, apparently. Oh, he's about dead. All right, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, just here. Whoa. Merry Christmas, get down here. A sliver of meat. How neat. Is that water, or is that a message? That it's blood. Alright, we got a dude up there. So another guy on a horse. So lots of horse dudes, if we go that way. And they weren't super difficult, but they were difficult enough. I don't want to fight a ton of them. So, let's go down this road a little bit. Again, by down the road, I mean adventure just off the road. Oh, 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 what's this? Oh, it's a little telescope. Okay. You can use the bird's eye telescopes found in various areas to get a bird's eye view of the terrain the direction the telescope is facing. All right, so this looks over the lake. Oh, you can go anywhere. Okay. I'll be darned. All right, so we need to get down in this lake and deal with it. And, uh... There's all kinds of craziness over there. Huh. That's pretty neat. All right, so that tells us what that thing does. So I want to know about this. That looks like a cave, if I've ever seen a cave before. So can we figure out a way to get down in this water? I mean, probably we can just walk down it, right? I mean, it's just up there. It was an insurmountable cliff. Here, it ain't that far down. Well, that's a little far. Hold on. we got to find a place to get down in the lake from this side. There we go. Here we go. Ooh. 
dragonflies, all your normal lakey stuff. I want to go this way. I want to see what's up with what looked like a cave back here on the map. Really? Get out of here. Alright. Bunch of these stupid things. Huh. Yeah, it is a cave. Okay. What do we got? Or maybe it's not a cave. Oh, there's a cave there. There's a cave! What cave is this? Lindgrave Tunnels. Okay. Oh, there's things you can roll off. Well, first things first. Rest up. Refresh the flasks. And then we do the first thing I saw. Every elevator in Dark Souls, you look for this thing. Got it. I mean... Always look for that. Since the first game. What do we got here? Anything? Am I going to be attacked? Nope. An, uh, golden rune. Well, that wasn't a very good prize for all that work. I'm probably gonna die jumping down here. Oh, there's another one up there. Oh, okay. So there are two of these. Alright, well, I'm gonna die. Oh! I was only carrying 5,000 souls. Nothing major. <laughs> Nothing at all. So this time... We need to go to the right. Too early. Way too early. I panicked. Give me a break. Give me a break. I got no Kit Kat bars and I panicked. Come on. Let's try again. Ah, oh, you gotta be a, do a running jump. Okay. You gotta do a running jump when you see it. Close. I think we got it this time. I hope we got it. One can only pray. Da -da. See, we'll get it this time? I hope so.
Oh, we got this one. The one I don't want. Uh, at least it looks like you can get down here without dying. At least that's faster than waiting on the reload. Come on! Is this actually fast farther? Yeah, it is. Okay. Try again. Made it! Excitement. Did. There's nothing in this one. There's nothing in this one. There's nothing here. I could have gotten here just by walking off that ledge. Oh, Elden Ring? Make me sad. You're making me very sad. Alright. Let's see what we got. We got some tunnels. Go ahead and douse our light. All right. Ow! Ow! Helps if you hit him. Right. Acquire material. Oh, you can get smithing stone down here. Well, poop. I wish I had known that a long time ago. That would have saved me hours. Literally, probably would have saved me hours. Ow. Okay. The walls? Problematic. Ah, uh, yeah. I spent hours farming smithing stones off of soldiers. Well, that's what you get. No guides. <sighs> really? These guys are tough. Take a lot of hits. We go that way or this way? Let's go this way first. Uh, elevator. Okay, let's go the other way first. Take the elevator last. I wonder if the smithing stones on the wall. Uh oh. Um, regenerate or not. Oh, these guys do not take damage. And they don't get stunned from that. Oh, giant rat, of course. Why wouldn't there be? I'm trouble. I'm in major trouble. I'm in danger. Tee hee hee. There we go. 
Really? Thank you. Lordy. Single smithing stone. Man, I've used so many health potions already. If there's a boss down here, I'm going to be in trouble. These things have so much armor. It's crazy. Wait, 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 wait. Game, you already did it to me once. Fool me once. Shame on me. Fool me twice. Shame on me again. Yeah, there's nothing there. Okay. Ah, there is. But there is. Respawn spot. one of them here. Oh, that's no good. The ones with backpacks are a problem. And we have a patrol. Okay. And we have a sleepy guy. Oh, the guys with lanterns call everybody to you. Okay. Can I hide? Oh, there's no hiding. Not from this guy. Oh, 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 oh. I see. Your existence is an unfortunate reality. Remember, Grug, you just bounce off of them. Alright. Well, we're about dead. Okay. Throw another set. <laughs> oh, no. Really? Does he just get to keep going? He has no pause in his animation. That seems unfair to me. Okay. Well, we're in trouble. We are in some trouble. Okay, we got one guy there with a lamp. Ah! Do not strike twice. If you don't get the back attack, just move on. Glintstone scrap. Break gem. Use FP to produce a magic bolt. Poor quality and hereby easily broken. Sorcerer wouldn't give it a second look. Well, good for him. Good for a sorcerer. Ah, mine's better. <laughs> that guy blew up. That was funny. Uh, so I'm assuming this just goes down to where I was supposed to go.
I I don't have what's needed to fight a boss right now. I don't have at all what's needed. I mean, this is a boss room, right? Yeah. That's a boss. Oh. Oh. My worst nightmare. Now that I know, I'm super upset. I really wish I had known. If I had, my life would be different. Well, fire does a lot of damage to him. I mean, a lot. I think I can probably just run to him, right? Like... I think I can just run right at him, I think. This will also tell me if all those smithing stones, like, repopulate or not. Alright, so our goal is to just pretend I don't exist. Yep, goodbye. Ah, oh, there's no... Come on, come on, come on, come on! Let's go! Jerks! Alright. Think we can do this? Dummy. I think we can do this. I hope we can do this. Seems unfair. Oh, get off his leg. That's not where I want to be. Uh oh. Uh oh. Got him. Didn't need a lot of the uh ohs there, apparently. Ooh. All right, we got the Roar Medallion. All right, what does the Roar Medallion do? Ah, uh, 
A bronze medallion depicting a roaring giant. Enhances roars and breath attacks. In ancient times, the giants were mortal enemies of the Erd Tree. Their bellowing roars desolated nature, triggering avalanches and whipped up storms of flame. Huh. Okay, well, let's go back. And then here's the question. Can I farm this place for smithing stones? Because... Because, dear reader, I need a bunch of level 1 smithing stones. I need a, a plethora. I mean, literally, like, I think 100. In order to upgrade our equipment properly. So now we check and find out. If the places on the wall repopulate, that would be handy. Oh wait, was there not a site of... Oh, that was the exit. That's right. I was like, where's the, where's the grace sign? There it is. Alright, so now we find out if these guys, if this place is going to be awesome, but where I personally live off screen for quite a while. Oh, shoot. Alright, so the ones that you can loot do not come back. That's unfortunate. These guys give okay souls. He did not blow up. The other guy blew up. I think if I use my axe or the uh, the sword, I might kill these guys in two hits instead of three. Come on. Let's find out here in a second. Checked all that. Where did this go? Because we jumped off this. We didn't go all the way down. We jumped off there. If you take this all the way to the bottom. got a dog. Large glintstone scrap. Oh, hi, buddy. There we go. So this does hit hard enough to uh, put them in that state. Okay. Large piece of glintstone tinged with unstable magic found in crystal tunnels. Break gem using F FP to produce a magic bolt. Poor quality and easily broken. A sorcerer wouldn't give it a second look. Anything over here? That's what I was talking about. Yeah. A 
I'd like to upgrade ooh, my axe to level three, and I'd like to upgrade my um, sword to level three. Is there nothing else here? That's it? Okay. Ah, so you have to jump off. Okay. But these guys, so is that all I get out of that whole cave? Hmm. I really, really don't want to have to farm warriors for smithing stones. <laughs> so you could jump off there if you wanted. And if only they dropped. Okay, there's this guy. Oh, so if you hit him in the back. They die in one hit from that. Okay. Well, that's acceptable. Now, where did those rats come from? They're not here. Where do the rats come from? Ah, they come running up the tunnel. Okay. Oh! Well, that's the entire cave. I mean, that was nice. But I was hoping they would drop stones. Wait, is that an item I missed? No. I was hoping those stones would come back on the wall. Uh, that we'd be able to get them. Or that these guys would drop stones. Because I really need stones. Uh, I'm going to try one more. Oh no, where am I? There we go. Where are we at? 33 minutes in now. Let's adventure more. We got some of what we need. I'm okay with that. Let's get out here and... Later, suckers. Alright, so what else we have on this lake? Uh, let's just walk around this lake. Let's walk back towards these ruins. Maybe check out that little island. See if there's anybody living underneath these ruins like there have been underneath all those others. It seems to be a pretty common thing. Oh, no, there's a giant crab that lives underneath there. Okay. Uh, we fought giant crabs before. We got this little island here. What's going on in this little island? Oh, I can summon my uh, jellyfish. Oh! Okay, that's the dragon. There's a dragon here. Okay. Well. Note to self. Let's see where we spawn. Hopefully I don't spawn down in the middle of that cave. Um, that's a big dragon. I'm not going to be doing that dragon this episode. Oh, that thing was scary. I have even no idea how you would fight that.
Oh, and now he just lives here forever. Okay. Dragonvert Ruins. I have the wrong item equipped. Hi, Shaggy Dog. Look, guys, I did mean to come in here to start a whole bunch. I didn't realize the whole dragon thing was what it was. Ow! Take it, dog! Lordy! Yeah, I know. I know. You shouldn't be here. You chose a bad place to hang out. The name? Quiet. The flame of Archaea burned true. So they're worshipping the dragon. Well, that's unacceptable. Not after what it just did to me. More golden rooms. Alright, let's go down here. What do we got? We got rats. Ow! I'm not sure how that one got behind me, but it's bad. How did that one get behind me? I don't know how I got surrounded there. Hold on, we're going back down in there. That was silly. How did that rack... I should have just backed up. Should have just backed that train right on up. What I should have done. What I should have did. Alright. Uh, nope. Don't want nothing to do. Alright, something is chasing me. I'm so turned around. Alright, hold on. You. Die. Ooh, a stone sword key. Alright, listen. Can we all just leave me alone? Can we do that? It doesn't have to go this way. Not at all. Like, I literally just want to go down here. That's all I want. You gonna leave me alone? Because if you do, we don't have to mess with nothing. Come on, buddy.
And there are more coming. No. Okay. Them coming in behind me or anything weird like that, right? Is this like the super rat? What is this? Get out of here. The rune art. A shard of the Shattered Elden Ring grants the blessing of an equivocal great rune upon use. Even if no great rune is equipped, it will slightly increase maximum hit points upon use. It is said that the lower arch of the Elden Ring receive its bounty, and this is a shard of one such arch. Well, it's got a one on it, so I get a feeling like it's a one and done type deal. I'm not using that right now. In fact, I'll probably never use that. None. But a transporter trap. Not a mimic. But a trap nonetheless. Unexpected. Where will we go? What adventure have we gone on? Celia Crystal Tunnel. Oh boy. Okay, that probably transports us back. What in the world is going on here? What have I walked into? You guys not hostile as long as I don't hit you? I take your crystal, are you angry? Yes! And you have massive, just like the other guys, okay. That's no good. Okay. This place is scary. But we know it's there. Let's... We know how to get there now. Let's go test the theory that if we use... Oh, where will we spawn? I wonder. Oh. Okay. So, what if... Are you hostile if I just walk? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There's all kinds of upsetness here. Is there a way out of here? Can I just book it? Book it this way? Oh, they cast magic. Can I please... Okay. It's a spawny thing. We got a ladder. Who uses ladders? Aha! That's what I needed. That was the important part. Alright, where am I? I'm way over here. I'm way off the map. Okay. Got some rot grease. That's new, isn't it? So 
Solidified grease made from a mixture of rot materials. Scratchable item. Coats armament and inflicting scarlet rot. The effect lasts only for a short time. Oh. Oh. Oh, this is a new and unsettling land. What's all this? Weird fungus. Oh, ho, ho. this is a terrible place. Uh, new materials or same materials as everywhere else? Faded earth leaf flower. An early flower that has faded to a pale scarlet, found blooming in rotten lands, said to be fed by leaves that fell from the earth tree in days of antiquity. All right, well, that's... I mean, that's obviously a big bad thing. That's a big one of those... Oh. Oh. Is it trying to mate with the one way over there? Who knows? Oh, let's not be under it. Let's do a test. Uh, yeah. They don't care about that at all. Uh, poison dogs? How bad? How tough are you? Oh, you're pretty tough. Give it me some kind of infection. Just really? And now he's dead. Didn't be spoons. Rotten straight. Oh, I got ashes for that doggy dog. Ashen remains in which spirits yet dwell. Spirit of a stray dog corrupted by the scarlet rot. Though it is only a small creature, it is violent as it is nimble, and its fangs fester with poisonous rot. Well, that's hip. Is that a... Aw, oh, that's what I need. That is the most important thing in the world. Oh, no. Nope, nope. I don't care. Don't care about you. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, nope, nope. Get away from me, weird. Snail wings. Celia, the town of sorcery. Can I, uh, can you go away? No. Oh. Apparently if you hit it with fire, it has a bad time. Let's see where it sends me. Let's see where it sends me to wound up this episode. Hmm, I got the yawns. Sorry about that. Pardon me. We're definitely in a part of the map we shouldn't be in. Okay. Stop by the shack beyond the southern gate. What shack? Swamp of Aenea. Yeah, we are ill-equipped to be here. What are you all about? Okay, fireworks. What in the... 
attack. Thing's got four arms. And it's scary. There's a little party going on right there. I don't want to be a part of that party. I want that. That's my goal. Oh, why are you so big? What are you doing? Come back here. Leave my prices alone. What did I get for that? I got nothing. Why didn't I get a prize? Oh, no. Oh, no. This map is as big as Limworth is. This game is going to be like 800 hours. Welcome to the town of sorcery. I didn't even even need walls. Your whole house is your whole town is busted up. Where's this go? Like just go this way. Let's adventure onward. That's the shack. There's a gate. Okay. What does this say? Stop by the shack. Uh, we will give it a shot. It's the end of the episode. Let's find out what's over here. I just don't want to aggro that dog. That's a scary dog. I'm here. Hi, Gowry. Oh. A pleasure to see you. A pleasure indeed. I am Gary, a great sage. In my day, anyway. I'd hoped to ask a favor when one of your ilk came along. A strapping young tarnished, able to cross the scarlet swamp of Aeonia. Don't fret. I'll provide fine recompense. Should you accept, I will teach you the secret of Celia, the town you see there. Sure. Ah, then you are willing to lend a hand, are you? I need your help to heal a certain young girl. Her name is Millicent. You will find her beyond Celia, resting at the church atop the cliff, stricken by the rotting sickness. The rotting sickness that afflicts Millicent has no cure. When the Erd Tree flourished, even the demigods could not stave off its effects, despite their nigh godhood. 
But Millicent's suffering can be ameliorated. For this, you are to find a certain needle. Seek the deep scarlet swamp of Aeonia outside Celia's bounds. The needle, made from unalloyed gold, is lost somewhere there. Okay. First, you must find the unalloyed gold needle. It's hidden somewhere in the deep scarlet swamp of Aeonia. Then I will tell you, as promised, the secret of the town of Celia. First, it's hidden... The okay. All right, well... What I really need is what is another um, place of grace is what I kind of really need. Is there one up in the other part of this house? Oh, no. The rest of this house is a lie. All right, can I just run by the dog? Okay. Uh, Alright, we got a gate. Got stupid dragonflies. Is that a statue or an enemy right there? Oh no, it's moving. Some glass. I really just want to find another point of grace. Uh, you know. You'd think there'd be one near a giant structure like this. But I don't even know where we are. That's not good. That giant knows we're here. Let's be somewhere else. Ho 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 ho! Look at Grug. Whoa! I bet you you're probably supposed to like find some way to get through there. It's supposed to be real difficult to get in that swamp, but when you take the back door, uh, none of this is... What is that? Is that just a dog, but it's far away, so it looks weird? Yeah, it's just a dog. Let's just go down this road real quick. <gasps> what? Hold on. Oh, tell me you have... Who are you? And tell me there's a thing nearby. Buy and more selling. What do you sell? You got a key? Make rot bone arrows in equipment. He sells flaming bolts, and he sells the champion headband, and the great helm, and gravity's advantage. Okay. Well, I want the stone sword key for sure. Let's look at these other things we haven't seen before. And I want his cracked pot. Headband reserved for the Badlands Bravest. Pollings after the chieftain Hora looks. The brave warriors of the Bandlands shun excess adornment. This great helm, sturdy great helm made from iron, though it is uncomfortably heavy and obstructs the vision of the wearer, provides considerable damage negation. Champion Pauldron, Pauldron reserved the Bandlands' bravest. Following the example of their chieftain, who looks, the brave warriors of the Bandlands shun excess adornment. Hey, that lady that fought with us, that gave us stuff. 
She's one. Braces reserved for the Badlands Bravest. Proof the wearer has slaughtered countless foes. And uh, the Gators. Worn with leather straps. Common wear in the Badlands. Alright, so we need a lot of money here. I would like to do the following. Is that another giant dog up there? What is that thing? I don't know what that thing is. All right. Here's what we're going to do. Uh, this is 6,000. Well, that's not 6,000. Alright, and then... How much is one of these? Four hundred? All right, so... There's four thousand more. Not finished yet. All right, so I want this. I want this. I want this. I want this. Gravitational power that pulls can bring flying... Th oh! That makes sense. So if you have one of those gravity things on your weapon, you could cause enemies like flying stuff to crash to the ground. Or maybe a flying boss, perhaps. Oh, a map! Okay. I got the map for here, but not for this section of the world. Uh, I'm going to keep going this way. Uh, what I am going to do, though, is... No. i got to remove that. Gallery Shack, and over here, a boss for later lives right here. And a boss we have to fight lives right there. Okay. Well, we're over an hour now. I did not expect this. I tell ya. Okay, they're giant, terrible, misshapen birds. That's what they are. They're a terrible monstrosity, and I don't want nothing to do with them. Um, I think we might just get on the horse and go. For another minute or two, until I can find a point of grace, or I die. Because I don't want to just end the episode just out here. Middle of nowhere. Let's just go. Besides, we gotta make our money back. Ah, uh, oh, come on. Of course, the concern is the longer the episode goes, the more chance there is the recording computer will fail. That's just a dragon. Decaying Ezekius. He's back there. Uh huh. Oh, oh! Get off of here! I want nothing to do with you. Oh, okay. All right. Decaying Ezekiel is where? Right back there. I want to mark him on the map. I came in hot on that one. There he is. Right in front of me. 
right here. Is a boss. Woo! All right, folks. Well, we found a point of grace. Um, we're in a part of the world we shouldn't be in. A part of the world which is huge, by the way. Um, like, there's so much to see. And we found another random dragon boss, so that's going to be fun. So, folks, we'll wrap up there. Until next time, I want to say thanks for watching. Please tell your friends. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe. And as always, we hope to see you soon. Hey.